years now, scientists have been searching for the missing oil from the 2010 Deepwater Horizon oil spill disaster. A new study reveals about 10 million gallons of crude oil has settled on the bottom of the Gulf of Mexico. Local 15's Madupe Idowu explains how the spill from four years ago is still affecting businesses today. Flounder is a prime example. They're probably 90% gone from the area. Ralph Atkins has been in the seafood industry for more than 50 years, but the last four have been tough. After the oil spill, we started seeing uh, lack of production and a lot of stuff. Shrimp are affected, the crabs, a lot of the fish. And I'd have anywhere from 10 varieties of fish, maybe even more, maybe 15. And as you can see, this only, I only have four varieties today because that's all I could find. Close to 200 million gallons of oil spilled into the Gulf of Mexico four years later. And a new study shows the, quote, missing oil has been found. It suggests 10 million gallons of crude oil has made its home at the bottom of the Gulf, putting the wildlife and marine ecosystems in jeopardy. It is my theory that I think the oil has affected and killed the little delicate, minute little creatures, the little tiny fish, the little tiny crabs, the little tiny shrimp, and what they feed on. According to BP, there is no missing oil. In a statement, the oil giant said oil was dissolved, evaporated, diluted, biodegraded, photooxidated, chemical reactions caused by exposure to sunlight or removed by offshore. Regardless, Atkins knows one thing's for sure. The oil spill affected his small business and other small dealers. We've lost four dealers that are gone that I used to deal with. Little people can't, you know, get out there and work anymore. Dupe Edo, Local 15 News.